The one-to-one -one meetings allow you to get a little bit more personal, a little bit more in-depth with the issues that you're facing, and it allows for you to connect in person, you know, face-to-face -face with um, someone who's going to be responsible for a large portion of your job duty. The value to one-to-one -one meetings is immense because it introduces me to people that I would not have otherwise had the opportunity to meet, and rather than me have to put all the legwork together to meet these in-house counsel, they're all brought to me in one and a half days, and I'm able to meet a whole series of them really quickly. They help you set it up so it's not like at an INTA meeting we're having to meet people you don't know who the vendor is, you're running around from hotel to hotel, it's here, it's much more concentrated and nicer and it's sort of more organized for you. Uh, they're critical. There's in, in this industry, in the legal industry, where you're dealing with complex commercial litigation matters, the only way to develop that type of business and relationship is through one-to-one -one discussions. Um, the op opportunity to meet new people, um, get a sense of how they define practice areas, uh, how issues I'm familiar with, uh, familiar with relate to issues that um, uh, a lot of the firms present, uh, a lot of the firms situated globally and here in the country. It's good to meet, meet somebody face-to-face, -face, which is you know nice considering our climate. And it's also good to see what they can offer in terms of whether, you know, um, fee structure is a big thing for me and in my company. So that's one thing I can ask questions of 